Hello bakers and welcome back to Bradley's Baking Bible. Now Mother's Day is fast approaching and if you haven't had time to get a present yet, but you like baking, then I've got the perfect gift for you to make. Light and fluffy cupcakes topped with a rose swirled buttercream and these incredibly moorish macarons make this Mother's Day bouquet better than any flowers you could buy. To begin, you'll want to use our simple cake mix to make your cupcake batter. The full tutorial will be below, but you'll need six ounces of butter, sugar and flour, and three eggs. Add in a teaspoon of vanilla and the zest of one lemon and then mix until smooth. Fill your cases halfway with your cupcake mix and then bake in the oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 15 to 20 minutes until a skewer comes out clean. Once cool, you can whip up a batch of our simple buttercream icing with four ounces of butter and eight ounces of icing sugar. I'll leave the full tutorial down below. Place two to three tablespoons of the icing into a separate bowl and color with pink food gel. Fold the icing bag over a glass and then press the pink icing thinly around the sides. Place the remaining white icing into the middle and then squeeze until the color comes out evenly. Core out the middle of your cupcakes and then fill each with a teaspoon of lemon curd. A 1M icing tip should give you a nice rose finish. So start in the middle and then swirl your way to the outside. For the macarons, you'll need to sift 100 grams of icing sugar and 100 grams of ground almonds into a bowl. Whisk two egg whites until it forms soft peaks and then add in some violet food coloring. Continue whisking while you slowly pour in 55 grams of caster sugar until you have stiff peaks. Fold half of your dry ingredients into your egg whites until mixed through and then add in the remaining mixture. As you continue to fold, the mixture will thin slightly. This is perfectly normal, so keep on going until you have a drop consistency that is thick but pipeable. Place into a bag and pipe two centimeter circles onto a baking tray. Gently tap your tray onto a work surface to knock out any air bubbles and then leave your macarons to stand for 20 minutes until they form a skin. Bake your macarons at 140 degrees Celsius for 20 minutes and then leave in the oven to cool completely and dry out. Sandwich your macarons with some more lemon curd and then place it in the fridge to chill. Now I've managed to find one of these cupcake bouquet boxes online for a few quid which are perfect for holding your cupcakes in place with this clever plastic tray. If you can't find one then you can always use a plant pot and put a polystyrene ball in the middle to secure your cupcakes. Assemble your cupcakes on top of your bouquet. Place your macarons onto cocktail sticks and then use them to fill the spaces in between your cupcakes. I've also twisted some strips of green fondant to act as leaves in the middle. And you're done! This edible Mother's Day bouquet is the perfect gift and it's bound to blow your mum away. So there you go, the perfect last minute gift that looks priceless. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you next time.